it's like easier. The bar's set really low for anyone who I date in the future to come in and be like a great guy. I'm having more fun during this time of my life than I've ever had before. Le I've legitimately never been happier. So you can either recognize it and embrace it or you can deny it and pretend it's not happening. I don't care what anyone says. I don't care that you have tattoos. I don't care that you have a, d a gap between your teeth. Like, I love you for who you are. I'll be like, how? Oh, you exist? This is crazy. <laughs> so it's like easier the bars set really low for anyone who I date in the future to come in and be like a great guy. I'm having more fun during this time of my life than I've ever had before. I've legitimately never been happier. So you can either recognize it and embrace it, or you can deny it. Pretend it's not happening. I don't care what anyone says. I don't care that you have tattoos. I don't care that you have a A gap between your teeth, like I love you for who you are. I'll be like how you exist. This is crazy. Y'all get ready because we've got some juicy gossip straight from the queen of pop herself. Taylor Swift brace yourselves as Taylor spills the beans on the real reason behind her decision to dip her toes into the dating pool with none other than the Kansas City Chiefs charismatic. Tight end, Travis Kelsey gets ready for a roller coaster of emotions and a glimpse into Taylor's love life that might just leave you shake one of the major reasons why Taylor is absolutely obsessed with Travy. S. Because of how much effort he has been putting into this relationship, literally since day one. I mean, even before they were dating. Like, do you remember the whole thing where he was crushed? Taylor didn't pay any attention to him? Right in the beginning, no K, so imagine this, it's July 2000. 23, and on a chill episode of the Kelsey Brothers Heights football podcast, Travis spills the beans to his brother, Jason Kelsey, of the Philadelphia Eagles. What's the hot topic? A friendship bracelet with Travis Ditt. Gets that he crafted for none other than Taylor Swift ate the A, and the Swifty hearts are fluttering everywhere. Travis was all set to hand it over at one of Taylor's concerts. But the plot twist she doesn't do the whole meet and greet thing before or after shows to protect her golden voice and just... Like that, the rumor mill starts turning out whispers about Travis and Taylor possibly being an item. But hold up. There's a twist in the tale of Travis's message finds its way to Taylor. Maybe thanks to a LL. It'll nudge from Fox sportscaster Aaron Andrews, who made a public plea on his behalf. But what's adorable about them is that both of them are equally invested. It did start out with Travis, but ever since then, Taylor has also been giving her 100 fast forward to September and it's game on. Travis throws the ball in Taylor's court, and what do you know Taylor shows up at one of his games? Not just as a spectator but as the ultimate cheerleader and get this, she's not just there for Travis. She's rubbing C. Holders with the MVP of all MVPs, Donna Kelsey Travis's mom's game day footage. Spills the tea on their instant connection with Donna and Taylor are hitting it off like long lost calls. When Travis scores that touchdown, Taylor goes full in fan mode, jumping, high-fiving, and basically being all of us. Watching the game, but hold on to your hats, because the real kicker is the seemingly ranch meme that takes the internet by storm. A post on X, formerly Twitter, captures the moment Taylor all her game day glow. Ori is spotted munching on fried chicken with ketchup, and seemingly ranch cues the viral sensational post-game victory celebrations aren't your average pizza and beer affair. Oh no. Not for Taylor and Travis, they take the party to the next level at Prime Social Rooftop in swanky Kansas City restaurant. Travis rents out for the crew. It's a private shindig Taylor Travis and the whole squad living their best lives fast forward to September 27, and Travis Kell takes a ride on the Honesty roller coaster op. Eating up on the podcast, he spills the beans about the whirlwind that followed his game day review with Taylor Reality Check. Paparazzi are now camp outside his house. Courtesy of the Taylor Swift effect, Travis can't help but gush about Taylor showing up to to cheer him on the ultimate power move, right? But it's not all glitz and glamour. Travis also shares the sweet sentiments from friends and family, who seem to be giving Taylor the thought thumbs up, however, in a twist that no one saw coming Travis read. 
Veal's a change in the podcast playbook from now on. It's all about sticking to sports talk. Why, well, in his own words, I know I brought all this attention to me. What's real is that it is my personal life. And I want to respect both of our lives, respect Travis, we can totally get behind that decision. Hold on to your hats, folks, because October 14 at to 15 is a weekend for the books Travis Keys and Taylor Swift takes their love story to the iconic Saturday Night Live stage, turning the NFL's Swift Mania into a full-blown spectacle. The SNL delivers a skit that puts the NFL in the spotlight, thanks to the sudden outbreak of Swift Mania. But wait, it gets better Travis and Taylor. Just happened to be in the audience, and the SNL gods decide it's cameo time. Travis makes a sure pra appearance at the end of the NFL skit, while Taylor takes the steez to introduce the musical guest Ice Spice. During their second number, the crowd goes wild and social media explodes with excitement after the SNL magic to keep the party going at the after party. And you beta Travis and Taylor is front and center. But the fun doesn't stop there. The dynamic duo extends their N. Why see escapade to a dreamy dat? A night the next day now. Let's talk about those cozy hand-holding photos that light up the internet according to the body language experts. In the know Travis and Taylor aren't just posing for the cameras, they're practically broadcasting their intimate loving connection. And here's a little insider. Scoop, apparently at one point, Travis goes full on and shining armor mode, telling Taylor's security guard, step aside, my friend. I've this October 18 that brings another chapter in the Taylor and Travis saga, and this time, it's all about love and real estate. Travis Kell, the man who's been sweeping Taylor off her feet, goes all out to make her feel special. How you ask by shelling out a cool $6 million for a new mansion upgrading to a secluded paradise in Kansas City as the paparazzi frenzy reaches new. Heights and privacy becomes a precious commodity takes matters into his own hands. The new a mansion isn't just a house. It's a fortress shielding their love story from the prying eyes of the world it seems like. Travis is determined to create a a place where Taylor can feel cherished, away from the constant glare of the spotlight. Now that's what we call a grand gesture of love and commitment. Plus, she also loves him because he respects her privacy, but isn't ashamed of loving her in public in the face of a bold reporter's inquiry about matters of the heart. Travis Kell plays it cool and keeps his cards close to his chest. When asked directly if he's in love, Travis responds with a smile, saying, I'm going to keck. Ep, my personal relationship personal. It seems like the tight end is all about maintaining a bit of mystery when it comes to matters of the heart. And when the inevitable question about Taylor's presence at the next game comes Travis sidesteps, it like a pro when I mention or everyone knows she's at. The game, the Vegas line, and over-under on my catches. Go up and down, he explains, with a chuckle, so I don't want to mess with any of that stuff. Travis Kelsey master of keeping both love and football on the A down low when Travis achieves a major career milestone by becoming the Chiefs' all-time leading receiver after a triumphant 2114 victory against the Miami Dolphins in Germany, Taylor. Swift is right there with him even from afar despite not being able to attend the game. Taylor finds a way to shower support for Travis, how well in the world of celebrity gestures liking. And in the Instagram post might seem like a run-of-the-mill move. But hold the phone because when Taylor hits that heart button on people's posts about Travis's achievement, it's a very big deal and we know she really loves him because she's doing stuff for him that she has never done before talking about a love story that hits all the right notes in this picture, Taylor Swift. The queen of surprises takes the stage in Argentina. And the, the atmosphere is already electric. But then she throws in a curveball during her performance of Karma that leaves everyone in, in a heartwarming twist. Taylor tweaked the lyrics of Karma to make. A special shout out Travis Kelsey, the modified line goes karma is the guy on the Chiefs coming straight home to me. 
The crowd goes wild and the lovebirds' connection takes center stage after the show. In a moment straight out of a romantic movie, they were darts off the stage and into Travis's waiting, arms sealing the night with a big, heartfelt kiss. The two had also been spotted enjoying a cozy dinner together the night before. Setting the stage for this magical moment, Travis clearly moved by Taylor. S. Lyrical Gesture later comments on the unexpected lyric change, saying it blew me away. These two are tight with each other's families, creating this warm, cozy vibe that feels like a big, loving hug, Kelsey. And the Swifts aren't just watching from the sidelines. They're part of this grand love story, and they're here for it. So what do you think down below? And let us know if you like for this video, click the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to be the first to see my next video. I post updates like this every week where I uncover the secrets of your favorite celebrities.